Here's a little bit of a secret feature on the Monkey application. So here I've specified a custom playlist online, a VBML playlist that's called the Mandalorian. So I'll open it. Here you have the track listing of the, of the playlist itself. And what's particular here is the fact that all these tracks only have title. They don't have track sources. It's just the title and just the cover of the track, meaning that I could go through them uh, on the semantic player here um, without being able to play. As you can see, there's no play button, so it's a little bit annoying. It's a, it's a little bit of a problem, uh, if you want. But since we're using a semantic player, um, and feel free to go on the Omega homepage to find out what is a semantic player exactly, we have um, an option here, which is the more like this option. So I can click on that. And this option essentially runs um, um, a search query uh, on DuckDuckGo in order to find related tracks according to the current track title. So here, as you can see, we have the query that got populated with the current track we're on, and we found uh, related tracks here uh, to the current uh, title we're browsing. So we could also search on YouTube, uh, we could search on Dailymotion, you know, and, and a few other. And so it means that even, even when your playlist is like a grocery, uh, it's like a grocery a shopping list of some kind, and you don't have a particular source attached to the track, you're still able uh, to ask the semantic player to uh, reconcile, if you want, uh, content for you. And so that can be useful when the content is censored or pulled down or when something is a little bit sensible. Uh, you know, you might be able to find what you're looking for by running essentially a more like this search and then browsing horizontally uh, the content until you find what's relevant with uh, the current track you're on. And so I'll actually, I'll show you the video tag attached to the playlist so you can check it out for yourself. So here I'm going to click there, click video tag, and there you go. So if you scan this video tag, you'll be able, you'll be able to open this playlist and summon the same searches that I did. Uh, and if I export it, it comes like this, which is pretty sexy if you ask me. So thank you for your attention and see you on the next one.